What's up guys and welcome to today's vlog. This vlog is going to be a pretty big one. I'm going to be turning 30, 30 years old in two days time, Sunday the 9th of August. So it's going to be a heavy weekend. I'm out here with Marion, Louis, Rob Lipsit, we have Stan the Man and Darren. So there's a full squad. We're going to have Owen as well joining us tomorrow. So it's going to be a very, very hectic weekend indeed. We're off to recruit one more member of the squad. He goes by the name of Owen Harrison. Came out to Ibiza twice last year and he was there. Even that the last time in October, we had such a good time. I could not have him missing out. Get in, son. Hey, can I get in there without a face mask? Nice, nice to meet you, bro. Nice to meet you, Darren. G. Story, all right. Nice to meet you, bro. What was the fight like? 30 minutes, mate. Up and down. That's pretty easy. That's pretty mask on. Yeah, mate, all that fucking. I use it as a chin strap, really. <laughs> you need a chin strap, though. When I fucking need one. <laughs> Don't put that on the video. <laughs> Dirty, he's getting old. He's not slowing down though. 42. <laughs> Speeding up. <laughs> We're in the prime, prime of our yeah, lives right now. There's a new 20, I don't care what anyone says. Man. When's your September? Yeah, four weeks. Jeez. Got yeah. any plans for that one? Yeah, yoga. Everyone's <laughs> <laughs> back over here again then. Just doesn't leave until after his birthday. <laughs> I'm staying here for four months. Hola. 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 ¿Qué tal? Italiano. Oh, no. What's going on, huh? Oh. We are just editing a photo. Here to have a party with her. Well, Mike. Okay. Well, Mike speaks okay. Spanish. So you're going to a you're going to the old town. Yes. Wow. No, no, not that one. Oh, no, not that one. oh, don't get that. I fucking face you. <laughs> so now we're gonna get changed, have a shower, head into the old town, have some s s s s s scran, aka food and then uh, probably have a few casual drinks, which with this lot, certainly not gonna be casual at all. Speech. Happy birthday, Uncle Mike. Cheers, crew. Cheers. Tell you what, guys, it's good to have you all here. Finally, this is, um, this is what I've wanted for the past few years. All my mates together abroad to celebrate my birthday. Turning 30 right now. We're gonna have a sip few days. Have a big sip of success. Sip success. Sip success. Aging like fine wine. Oh yeah, fucking hell. Yes. Come on. Yes. Yes. I'm water up and like I'm drowning. Like I'm running out of there. Ah, water up and like I'm falling. It's 2 a.m. here in Ibiza. Sounds and good. Darren's gonna take the camera and walk backwards, hopefully it's yeah. fall. Yeah. Um, but yeah, as you can see, it's pretty busy. Everyone's making their way home. There's nowhere to go right now. I've only had like four half pints tonight, so we're actually extremely sober. This is the yeah. most, yeah, yeah, most sober, sober Louis's been yeah. for a while. Yeah. He's done well tonight. Yeah. 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 We all just appreciate how well Louis's done. Louis is on 12 pints a day minimum. Yeah. Like, especially at this time. And here I am at four and a half. Four and a half, yeah. yeah. That's and like... Darren's able to walk backwards. Yeah. yeah. Keep walking in the position. Like, how hard is that, man? Oh, <laughs> obstacles everywhere. I know, I've tripped. Yeah. Wait! <laughs> and that's the last we ever saw of Darren. <laughs> <laughs> the only man ever, by the way, to start a vlog at 2 a.m. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, sometimes there's no better time. <laughs> All right. Good morning. It is officially the first day of being in my 30s. I've left my 20s behind. How does it feel, might you ask? Do I feel old? Absolutely not. If anything, I still feel like I'm 25. 
but the years do fly by. I remember my dad always told me this. He was like, enjoy your 20s because they will fly by and they certainly have them. It feels like yesterday I was 28 and now I'm in my 30s. So word of advice to all you guys who are still in their 20s, enjoy it, appreciate it. Enjoy every moment. Don't let the time slide by without even realizing because it will. And by the time you're 30 or 40, you'll be like, God damn, where did my youth go? My goal for 30 is to live an even better, more fulfilling, exciting life packed with new experiences. I feel like I didn't really start living until I was 28. Right? Before that, that wasn't living. Not in my book anyway. 28 was a great year. 29 was a great year. An even better year. 30, let's make that even better. Regardless of the situation which is going on around the world, I'm determined to make that the best year of my life. Each year has to be the best year of my life. Okay, I don't want to be 75 years old and have lived the same life 75 times. Absolutely not. I want every single year to be new, to be better full of new experiences and that should be your goal every time you turn one year older go out there be determined to live a better life and to live life to the fullest so today Nassau Beach Club having it off we got the boys here, there's about eight of us. We're gonna go to Leo later on tonight. Really sick place in Ibiza if you wanna go and have dinner and watch a show at the same time. Then, I don't think it's gonna to be too crazy tonight because tomorrow is probably gonna be the biggest day. This is a two day celebration. Tomorrow, we've got a yacht party sorted out. Shout out to a very good friend of mine who has very, very generously allowed us to go on his yacht tomorrow. So we're gonna have a big party on that. And it's gonna be an epic, epic two days. All right, so this is the real cheers, okay? So, let me take a little sip first. So I've um, made a poem of sorts for Mike, and this is uh, my best birthday gift to the man that has everything, so let's go, okay? Another year, another inch on the chest. There's no debate, Mikey G does it best. He smashes the YouTube, amongst other things. What I mean by that is one night flings. <laughs> we traveled the world together and we're still alive. On top of that, we made our bank accounts thrive. <laughs> We've got in some funny situations and nearly killed each other, but at the end of the day, I'd call him my brother. Oh, no, so here's to the next few days of fun, sun, and perhaps making some gains. <laughs> Cheers to that, bro. Cheers to that. That's Cheers awesome. to that, man. Fucking yes. The big man Gaz sort us out with a lovely table and a complimentary bottle of champagne. Gaz, I know you're watching this. I'm gonna steal all the dancers like you told me not to. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what have you got there? Whiskey sour, boy. Whiskey sour. I'm not normally the type of guy to drink whiskey sour, but why not? He's gotta do it. He's gotta do it. Let's test it. Test it. Test it. Out with ten. Perfect Good 
morning world. Feeling surprisingly fresh today, which is exactly what I had hoped for. Part two of the celebrations is about to go down. Today is yacht day. So I'm gonna round up all the troops, gonna head over to San Antonio, because that is where the yacht is based. And we need to do a drinks shop. There is no alcohol on board, so we need to make sure there's gonna be enough alcohol for everybody so we can throw a proper party. Probably a decent amount of drinks. We need two, two man crew, two big guys in here. And a passport, pass and a passport. And a, my passport is there, so. They took Moran's passport back. so that we wouldn't take the trolley. Is it? Yeah. Oh my god, bro. Yes! <laughs> the notorious Medusa. We had the pleasure of boarding this vessel last October, and we will be boarding it once again. So welcome to the Medusa. I think first things first, I'll give you guys a quick tour before we get the party started. So let's go into the living room. We have a little bar here. We have some DVDs there if anyone wants to watch a movie, which we certainly won't be doing today. Nice little sofa area. We have someone in the toilet. Here we have the downstairs area, which will go to the bedrooms. Bedroom number one. Pretty outrageous, if you ask me. Toilet, ensuite, we've got a TV as well. We also have two bedrooms with single beds here. I think there's a kid's room in there. That could be for the crew, I don't know. This is my boat. And then we have another bedroom here. Quite ridiculous. Fairly ridiculous. I would not complain if I was going to stay on here. It's better than most hotels I've been to. So let's go upstairs. Oh. We have a bar here, sitting room here, we've got the driver's seat there, we've got a jacuzzi here. We also have a nice little tanning area here, or a little dancing area as well. So, uh, it's going to be a ridiculous day. What better way to celebrate your 30th than being on a friggin' yacht with your boys? The plan is... We're gonna go Calicomte, which is a bay nearby here. You can only have 12 people or 12 passengers on board the vessel whilst it's moving, it's the law. So we're gonna drop anchor. Once we've dropped anchor, we can get more people on board. You're going on holiday, you're going swimming. The only pair of shorts you should be wearing is the first shorts. I've worn the black yeah. ones. I have two for you, Mariah. Oh, sweet. Do you have a choice? Oh, wow. Of the red? That's dope. Or you also have a choice of the black. Oh, no. That's another pair of red. Yes, it's two pairs of two red. Two pairs of red. <laughs> <laughs> hey. We're about to drop anchor in Calicomte. Beautiful, beautiful beach we were there a few days ago, but it's a hell of a lot better when you actually on a boat instead of on a packed out beach. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get the jet skis out for the first hour whilst everyone is relatively sensible and sober. And then we're gonna put them away, get additional passengers on board, have a little bit of a party. Wow, there's a lot of, there's a few there was a few. There was a few ways I wanted to describe those passengers, but I'll just leave those passengers. <laughs>
so it's the following day. What an unbelievable day that was yesterday. Couldn't have asked for a better 30th birthday. I'm surprised we even managed to pull it all off, to be honest, with everything that's going on. Managed to bring everyone together, have a sick time on the boat. Would have liked to have got more footage, but safe to say that all cameras were put away after sunset. It's probably for the best. So that is that. Party weekend is over. The boys are going back home. Louis going back home. Rob's gone back home. Ryan's gone back home. I think Owen's going to stay with me for a few days. But uh, I would say the last month, it's probably been the funniest month I've had for a very long time. If there's one thing I've missed, it's just hanging out with my best mates and just having a laugh with them every single day. Like, it really has been so funny. So now it looks like it's back to the chilled vibes, back to old routine, training, eating good, doing some work, and still exploring the island. And uh, I think Louis will back out and get some more content together in about three weeks' time or so. But he's got to go back home and quarantine, like everybody else, unfortunately. So that is that. Thank you very much for watching the vlog. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you in the next video.